All right, today we'll be featuring a Polynesian bakery I just barely found out about uh, and love it. It's called Sagato Bakery and Cafe. Um, and while let's go outside and let's uh, show you some of their more popular dishes and show you around. All right. Loy and Tualagi Sagato start sharing their cooking talents in the early 90s in Southern California in local bakeries. When they moved to Utah, they continued to do the same thing. All the kids would be at a park in Kearns, Utah, selling steam buns and pineapple pies on a small table. They would sell out and have to walk a mile to the local Food for Less to make a phone call. Yeah, there were no cell phones back then, and they had to use this, a payphone. Their mom was chosen as the model for this picture, and the parents are still very much involved in the business. 20 years later, the kids are now running the business and sharing their passion. The parents are now over quality, but in this culture, you know they are still in charge. Well, let's go in back and show you how they make some of their pastries. What kind of, is like a jelly? Yeah, so this is the jelly and we use this for our cream puffs and our lambicans. Okay. Uh, it's also really good for writing on things. Oh, okay. But th those are probably the two main uses of them. How much of uh, the cream filling do you think you guys use through every day? Um, we probably go through three of these buckets. Three of those buckets? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so the cream for the cream puffs is a little bit different than all the other cream. We add a little bit extra sweetness and to make it a little bit more creamy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looks like it's so you cut it like in half a little, and yeah. then you'll dip it in chocolate, right? And then roll that in like a coconut, uh -huh. kind of like convection. Yeah. Oh wow! And then cream in the middle and a little bit of cherry. Okay. <laughs> Which is similar to. Yeah. <laughs>
The cream puff was awesome. That little bit of sweetness in the cream really made every bite enjoyable. They sell 200 to 300 cream puffs each day. The lamington looks really dense, but when you take that bite, the cake just melts and just fills your mouth with sweetness. This is a dessert. When I order one, I'm not sharing. You'll need to get your own. The sausage roll has just the right amount of pastry surrounding the roll of sausage in the middle. A perfect juicy bite paired with a light flaky roll. The mince pie is amazing. The ground beef and cheese just fill your mouth with a burst of savory flavor and has that same flaky crust that they have perfected. No wonder this is one of their most popular items. They sell 500 to 1000 of these each day. This is definitely a baker I recommend trying out and I will be coming back. Once again, this is how I chow.